Be careful. I'm not the one saying that. <coughs> Hello? Yeah, peace and blessings, man. This is Brother Saeed. I've been hearing your, uh, your comments, man. I would like to address the Muslim. All right, my friend. Go representative. Go ahead. Um, what, what was that verse that you were reading, sir? We are reading in the Quran, chapter 33, verse number 72. Okay, 33, 73. 72. <laughs> 72, okay. Okay, so reading from the English to the, uh, from the Arabic to the English, truly we did offer the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they declined to bear it and were afraid of it. However, man bore it. Verily, he was unjust to himself and ignorant. Now, what is your question, sir? My question, if everything living thing is from water, Allah is offering the sky and the earth and the mountains a trust and they refuse. How they refuse? Are they, they refuse. Yeah, how, they, how, how, the, how the mountain refuse? <clears throat> well, the Lord says it right here. How? The Lord the mountain can offered it to them. Yeah, but how you are, are you talking to who to the rocks? Well, the Lord is is addressing this the question that you're asking. You know, the Lord is saying we offered the trust mm. to the mountains. So the Lord is indeed talking mm. to the mountains. Okay, and, the, know, and the, the mountain heavens. they talk back, they say no, we don't accept. Well, this is because of the responsibility, as the Lord says in the verse. Yeah, but this so means the, the mountains, they have a brain, and they, they knew what is responsible and what is not, right? Indeed. Okay. Do you really believe that the mountains are, are living creatures, and they have a brain? And yeah, absolutely. Really? Absolutely, I believe. I, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, um, when you look at the, uh, the reality of um, birds and the way that they function and the way that they uh, operate in terms of waking up the rooster crocs uh, how, the, how, the the crocs how, how the birds function well the way birds function uh, according to the birds in, in my in my area you know um, every morning around five your time they start chirping you see around the and Friday uh, around the Friday they try to start doing what around five your hour the five your hour oh, is okay. the time that okay. Muslims pray mm -hmm. and, and so around this particular time <laughs> they always chirp, right? Mm -hmm. So we're talking about a design that Allah created mm -hmm. these birds to function on. So when the Lord is saying, I offered the heavens and the earth to take the responsibility of this trust, you know, we, we realize that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave it these functions to decide. And it reclined or it, it, it uh, declined the offering, you see. Um, in, which language, of, in which language Allah, he offered them the offering? In what language? Yeah. Well, according to the Quran, uh, before my calling you, you mm -hmm. read it in the Arabic. So, you know, just translating it into the English. It so, was in so, look, so look like those mountains that speak Arabic. The language that Allah was speaking? To the mountains. He was speaking When Allah Arabic? created uh -huh. creation? No, like when he, when he offered them those things, he, he spoke to them in which language? In which well, language, gotta, in which language well, they respond? Well, you got to understand, um, mm -hmm. uh, brother, that this revelation called the Quran was sent down to mm -hmm. Muhammad mm -hmm. in the Arabic language. So we're understanding a story. Mm -hmm. So according to the story that we're getting this revelation, we're getting it in the language that Muhammad spoke. Mm -hmm. So you see, in terms of the language that Allah spoke to the yeah. mountains and the heavens and all of these things, mm -hmm. according to what we got from this Quran, we just know that Allah is the creator of speech. Allah is the creator of language. Yeah, but how? But, so, but how? How the how the mountain they speak? I mean, you see, the, do the mountain have a tongue? Well, obviously not now at this particular time. So what happened? They lo they lost their tongue by time. What happened? Well, just by looking at what they did, they declined the offer. So by declining the offer, the Lord took away some of the things that will ah, be required to take. So the when trust. He created them, they used to have a tongue, and then by time, uh, Allah He cut their tongue because they declined the offer. So when Allah he uh, off, offered them that, what does that mean? He offered them Islam and they refused to accept Islam? Negative. Uh, what Allah offered was the trust. The trust mm -hmm. that uh, the whole purpose um, mm -hmm. of man on earth is to be a caliph, a ruler. Mm -hmm. You see, to have dominion over everything in creation. 
So the Lord offered this responsibility, but in knowing the duties of being a ruler, they declined this offer, you see? Mm -hmm. And this is why the man today is at uh, a folly. He's at a, you know, um, uh, uh, as the Lord says, he is unjust to himself because he's mm -hmm. forgotten how heavy this duty is, you see? Mm -hmm. And so now today, uh, the man is in a frenzy trying to understand uh, the geopolitics of governing people. <laughs> you see, mm. so you see, the, uh, even the angels, mm -hmm. when the Lord had created creation, mm -hmm. uh, told the angels, I will create a caliph or representative. Mm -hmm. And the angels had questioned God. Think mm -hmm. about the angels questioning the Most High. Will you create something that will cause corruption? The mm -hmm. Lord said, I know what you know not, because mm -hmm. the responsibility of being a ruler mm -hmm. is not easy. As mm -hmm. you see, the man is unjust. So when the Lord offered that to the heavens mm -hmm. and they re did, they re uh, declined, it was this mm -hmm. knowledge, this information about what it means to be a ruler that they were not ready to take. Okay. I hope that it can answer your question, question. my friend. You just mentioned the story of uh, Adam and the angels. Allah, he said, I will create a caliph. What caliph mean? Well, caliph, according to my <coughs> understanding, means a representative, a vice general, a successor. or Successor uh, of who? There's people living in the earth before? Well, the Lord, before the Lord even created Adam, there was a, according to the hadith mm. that I, that I can remember mm. before the Lord even created Muhammad mm. or the mm. first man, mm. life was already in, 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 it was already functioning. It was already life here. All right. So, so in uh, terms of who the ruler was, who was, heavens, who was down on earth was a man or was an angel? Well, Allah was the one keeping it, maintaining it, governing it. Okay. Uh, let, let, let's focus on that story. The angels they said to Allah that uh, uh, Adam would do mischievement, right? Indeed. Right. Okay. Yes. And uh, Allah He told them, "I know what you know not." Correct. Correct. Okay. Which means He is confirming that they are wrong about right. the claim of Adam. But isn't it Adam who commits sin later, and Allah kicked him out anyway, and they were right? Well, the, the, the well, I'm in terms of in terms of the storyline. Yeah, you're absolutely correct. The storyline is correct. I'm not okay. going to deny that. Okay. So how how Allah saying to them you are wrong when they are right? Well, in terms of the uh, the uh, the uh, like, so when you're looking at a story mm -hmm. and you know the the beginning, the middle, and the end of a story, mm -hmm. but the person who you're telling this, uh, uh, you're 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 a director of a movie and you're telling a uh, a. Uh, uh, Someone that you trust. Hey, I got this idea about a movie, and they and they and they're trying to understand the end of the movie, how the movie is going to end. But they're not the director. They're not the actual creators of the movie. Mm. So they're giving me their own opinion about how the movie would turn out. But they're not even the one directing it. So the angels were trying to think ahead mm. of Allah, mm. but Allah knew the end game. So you see, yes, indeed, the story started off with Adam sinning. Mm. However, the end game. Is not what they thought, and that's why the Lord knows what they know no, not. But Allah, but Allah told them, you know, not about what about him being a sinner. Well, about about the about the reality where Adam, the Adam and the children of Adam, the end game. You see, yeah. it's about this but, is a story. Okay, but but uh, Allah, sir? He said to them, He wanted to prove to them they are wrong, right? About what yeah. the the angel they would make, make one accusation that this person he would do mischief, and correct? Indeed. Okay. Was the was the angels right? Yes, Allah was wrong. How Allah said well, to them, "I know what you know not," and He wanna prove to them that they do not not nothing. And then to prove that story, He start teaching Adam all the names, and then He told the angels, "Well, okay, if you know uh, if you know better than me, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> recite the names of those things I taught to Adam." And He placed the things in the front of Adam, and He told them. Okay, tell me the names of those things. They said, Allah, we, we know not what you nothing, and we know only what you told us. So here, so you Allah, see they testified. They testified to exactly what okay, they did know. Okay, but the story right? here is not smart, my friend. Because if I, if let us let us say to you, I have a cat. Her name, I I call her Susu, and I say to you, my friend, do you know the name of my cat? You say no. Is that a proof that I am God because I I don't know the name of my cat? I am the one who gave the name for my cat. Allah, He named the things. To Adam, he taught him the names, and then he brought all the things in the front of the angels, and he said to the angels, "Give me the names of those things." The angels they said, "We give up. We do not know." How Allah He is proving to the angels that He knew what they knew not. If He is the one who gave the names, I mean, this is the most silly argument ever. 
Imagine, well, imagine, imagine. You call, well, the, you call your son, uh, let us say, Ahmed or Muhammad, and I see you in the street. We shake hands. You say, "Do you know my son' name?" I say, "No." He said, "Okay, I'll prove to you that I'm God. My son' name is Ahmed, but you are the one who gave him the name." Do you know what I'm saying? Well, I hear, I hear, I hear your your point, sir. But um, the reality is, when you're the one, when you're the beholder of information, and you only teach a certain amount of information to a creation then mm -hmm. you know it's just, it's just for example teenagers you know teenagers they think they know everything they have this you know uh this 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 obvious arrogance about themselves where they think that they don't have to you know listen to the guidance of their elders anymore because of this information that they think they have and then when something happens to them then they realize oh wow i actually don't know so much so the reality is the angels they they thought they knew everything because of what allah had put in them in terms of information friend, then when the Adam, angels, hold on let me let me let me just get this hmm. i mean so so then when adam was created and when adam was taught the names of everything hmm. the lord then presented the angels in front of adam and then questioned the angels about so what? now it's about it's the a battle about of information what? Question, a, question well, about what? the name the well the well the names, the names you okay. see in so terms of what, the information what kind, what kind of a smart exam that is exam to prove that i am the one who know and you do not know what about allah he do the opposite what if Allah he says to them, okay, I will give you those things, give them names as you wish, and then ask me what the names of those things, and then I will tell you that it will be a miracle. But I am the one who named the things, and then I say to you, I know the name of those things. This is the most silly argument ever. Are you getting my point? If he want to prove to them that he knew what they knew not, he knew the unseen, he should do the opposite. He should give them, any, he said, okay, you know what? Name anything you want around you. Do anything you want. Do something, some tricks, hide and seek. Do things I did not suppose to see behind my back and then ask me what we did and I will tell you that will prove that he is God But look what happened He brought a zucchini a cucumber uh, 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 A chair a table uh, a cook uh, uh, a, a couch and he start naming them. Okay, Adam. This is a couch. This is zucchini. This is a cucumber uh, This is a grape. Uh, this is a coca-cola. This is Pepsi Cola. This is seven up. Okay angels come here Give me the names of those things and the angels like what is that man? We do not know. This is how Allah he proved that he is all knowledgeable Absolutely, I mean what you gotta you gotta thing? understand they questioned the fact that they even questioned Allah Was was the was that was the wrong doing to question the laws uh, and you know infinite intelligence was the wrong the, and, and, and let's just go to the reality of the angels the angels were not created with free will so that the amount of things that they can do like you had gave a scenario just Go ahead and do what you want to do. Name anything. Do, like just that. Just imagining that. Just putting that in perspective. It's impossible for an angel because they're not created with free will. So they're they're, they're limited to what they can actually my friend, do. So, my friend, so my friend, my friend, my friend, friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. Hold on. You are what saying. You, wanna, you are what saying. You, what you, you, you want to do? What you want to do? Is you want to take the, uh, <clears throat> the, the, the the narrative? Mm. You want to take the narrative and 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 you know ridicule the narrative. But the reality is, you are not a lie. I am not a lie, and I did not create the story. The story okay, has friend, been created, okay. and we. Just are you saying must... to me? Are you saying to me that because you don't have a free will, because you don't have a free will, you cannot give a name to something? Is that the duty of an angel? No, no, no. This is not about angels. About anything. Free will. You said because angels have no free will, right? Yeah. Okay. No. So, can Allah give them a free will for one second and say, "Okay, go and name those things"? Can't He? But, but did He do that? Okay. But what here the story proved nothing to us. The I don't want to. I don't want to say a word. It sound like I'm insulting you. We are discussing a topic. I hope you will not be offended. But this is very silly to say. I am going to give names to things, and you have no free will. To know those two things because you just told me they have no free will so how he's asking them what is the names if they if he knew already that they have no free will to know and they have no free will to name them they have no free will to know them they have no free will to think they have no free, free will to do anything because you just said they are like just, just like toys he's controlling them and they have no free will so what is this debate is about it, the the point of me and you debating that you are free to answer the way you want i am free to to answer you the way i want if Allah is debating with angels who have no free will, this is a joke, because the answer well, is the answer is not right. the answer this is not made by them. The answer is made by Allah. Well, see that goes right back to the question <laughs> initially. Why this is the reason why the the heavens. This is the reason why in, in chapter thirty three, verse number seventy two. This is exactly the reason why the heavens and the earth did not take that trust, because the responsibility of 
of having the ability to say yay or nay. Okay, I would, I would, is, I would, I would go with you. Backlash. Do a human beings have a free will? Do human beings have a free will? Human beings, yes, they have a free will. That's false, my friend. Do you want to prove it to you? Well, according to the Quran, we have free will. Where it says, according to the Quran, you have a free will. Okay. Okay, so we go to if we go to chapter seven, hmm. verse number twenty-three. The Lord says, "They said, O Lord, we've wronged our souls. If you forgive us not and bestow not upon us your mercy, hmm. we shall certainly be of the losers." Hmm. So this is this is we're just going to stay on topic with Adam and Eve, right? Hmm. The fact that they're calling out to God, asking for a second chance hmm. to make up something that they did. All right, necessitates the will that is free. Okay, do you understand this verse better than your prophet? You asked me to show you in the Quran free yes, will. Yes, my friend, I'm asking you now. So I'm just, do you so I'm just showing because you are giving me your interpretation, which is wrong. Do you understand this verse more than your prophet? Like I said, you no, told no, me to I, give I, you an my example. Friend, my friend, my friend, no, you did not give me an example. I, I'm, I'm just saying to you. Are so you sure? Someone, so are, you, some, so are you sure? Asking, are you sure? Okay, hold out on, to God for, hold for, on. Are you sure that this Why verse? Calling out to God for forgiveness, my friend, my friend. Because they okay. did something. This is what right? they say. This is what they say. But is it true? No, this is what the Quran just said. I just no, read the, the Quran. Verse. No, the Quran says they, we. They said. They said. Do you know how to read, my friend? The Quran says, "Qala Rabbuna zalamna anfusana." They said, "Our Lord, we wrong ourselves." They said. Okay, they said, okay, you know who, now, so who are they? okay, do you understand this verse better than your prophet? Yes or no? So who, who do you are they? The, uh, Adam and Eve, do you understand? Okay. That, do you so, understand? So they did something, right? My friend, they, they did you, something. Do you they did, they did no something, problem, right? no problem. Do you understand? Come on, man. Come on, don't, don't, my friend, don't, my don't, friend. Don't, don't, okay, okay, okay. what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Do you under, <laughs> do you understand the Quran better than your prophet? Yes or no? Hey, look, man, that's a whole different topic now. You see, you know, how it go. Look like, ah, see, look like reality, you do not. You, you, are you, are you saying, are you saying you don't agree with your prophet? Right are, you saying, are, you saying, are you saying, are you saying, are you saying you don't agree with your prophet? Are you saying that your prophet is a foolish man? He do not know and he don't understand the Quran, but you know better. Are you saying that? What I'm saying is your question was answered. My about friend, no, you are not. Adam you are not. This is not Adam about the free will. This is not about free will. This is not about the free will. This is what they, they say. Allah is the one is so fooling them. Back. Allah, he deceived them. Allah, he deceived them. Allah, he made them commit sin. And I can prove it right now. You have no idea what are you talking about? Allah made them commit sin. This is huh? why you are, you, you are not accepting the challenge. I am saying to you, what if I show you your prophet explaining this verse and proving you wrong? What you will do? Show me then. Okay, no problem. Here we go. Thank you. Finally, he said, show me. I like it. It's a Sahih al-Bukhari in the front of me, and this is Sahih. All the hadith in the front of me is Sahih. Read with me carefully. The Prophet said, Adam and Moses argued with each other. Moses said to Adam, O oh Adam, you are our father who disappointed us and turned us out of paradise. Then Adam said to him, O oh Moses, Allah forced you, favored you with his talk, talk to you directly between two brackets. And he wrote between two brackets the Torah for you with his own, own hand. Do you blame me for an action which Allah has written for my, in my fate 40 years before my creation? So Adam, Muhammad continues saying, so Adam confuted Moses, Adam confuted Moses three times. Go ahead. Your prophet, he ad admit that Adam was a victim of a plan of Allah to commit sin. You cannot blame Adam for the sin he Adam he did, for this is was the plan of Allah, and Adam have no free will. Okay, so um, you're you're acknowledging the fact that he still was redeemed. This, see, is not, he, this, this, he, this is he, not he, our topic. He, don't change the topic. He, he, don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. You said. You said. Okay. But this is not about okay. redeem. This is about. Don't change the topic. This is about the free will. You said that a human being have a free will. He don't. 
he does no because I, he was the story i'm talking about is about adam and eve correct and here we go your prophet himself is saying that adam was the winner in this debate why he was the winner because you cannot blame adam for the sin he did for this is written for him 40 years it was the qadr of allah for him it is not his choice so how you say to me that the angels have no free will but the human being have a free will when as you see Adam sin it was nothing but a deception of Allah Allah is the one who fooled them Allah he made them do the sin you're a prophet he said if my nation if you people don't commit sin and ask Allah for forgiveness Allah will destroy you and bring people better than you who sin and ask for forgiveness so your God Allah have a game he like people to sin so he can make them us please Allah forgive us this is that this is the game as you see here Allah is Allah is, is using you is a playing with you he made you do sin he forced you to do sin and then he asked you to ask for forgiveness so he feel like he is God you have a self-esteem issue well <laughs> I see I see I see how you I see how you uh you know facilitating yeah your, your what facilitating this, this is in front of you it's in the front of you why Allah he made Adam sin you tell me it's in the front of you why he made him sin give me a reason Adam was a good person Allah did tribe him. Allah forced you, him to commit I'll sin. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. Why? I'll tell you why? why. Tell me why. Because everything is now revolving around the same verse that you had brought in the beginning about the Lord entrusting a responsibility to the heavens and the earth. Mm. The Lord <clears throat> wanted to create a caliph. So the Lord wants a caliph. This is what the Lord wants. And the Lord will get what the Lord wants. The Lord wants a caliph. So the Lord is trying to find the right victim. You see the right so victim, the guys. Did you, did you hear? Us. Did you hear the right the victim? Lord, <laughs> Lord. Allah trying to find the but right hey. victim. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> well, well it's still, but you know what it still does? It still establishes the my friend. I like you. I, I would like you day. to call me always. What's your name, by the way? What's your name? It's still. Hold on, I'm gonna tell you all that. I'm gonna tell you what, all what's that. What's your name? If you don't mind, if you don't mind. Once I, once I say my piece, what, what's your name? What's your name, please? What's your name? My name is Saeed. Saeed. Okay, Saeed. Listen, you just say that Allah He have to choose the right victim, right? Indeed, you admitted that your God is the devil, because why? Why he cannot fulfill his plan to create a caliphate for the earth without finding a victim? Can't he make Adam a caliphate for the earth without fooling him and making him do sin? What is the point? Well, well, well there's a there's a hadith kutsi where the Prophet Sallallahu said that when the Lord decided, the Lord wanted to be known. So in order to be known, the Lord created creation, and through creation, the Lord made himself Guys, look at this Allah so, created us to be known <laughs> exactly my funny so now, my, my friend my friend so let, on, let, me, on, let me ask let me ask you I understand I understand okay. that you have your own position against Islam but you know in terms of the respectability of one man's faith and another man's faith we must give each other the ability to express one and defend one's faith mm. don't you agree to that I agree and you just did you, just, okay. you are the one who said so, that so uh, now so you, now you are so the now one who said about, Allah Allah he, so, he chose so a victim on. and the victim is us hold on so let me tell you how this whole thing is going Mm. So the Lord wanted to be known and created a creation. Mm. There are 99 attributes that <clears throat> represent Allah. Mm. So in order for us to know the names of God, mm -hmm. you have the to Lord deceive must us. create creation. So you have to deceive so us. In how order can to you know, know that, that the Lord? How can you know that the Lord is good? Mm. And how can you know that the Lord is wrathful? Mm. You must create a. What is good? What is good about create, God? Must, what is good about on, God? But hold on, hold on. Hold on. See, what now, is what good? Doing, now what you doing is when you when you want to explain yourself. Then I then I then I give you the floor. But when no, I my friend, my friend. Myself, no, I want to hold you with your words before you forget because about them. You, you just said you, you just do, said you Allah. He control, wanted to be known. Hold on. Yeah, you just said that Allah. He wanted to be known. Yeah, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You are you are afraid from what you just said. You are afraid from what you just said. You just say that Allah wanted to be known. Hold on. Hold on. You see, guys. This guy he is afraid. He's terrified. Let me speak. He has a fright. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. You say that Allah, he wanted to be known and he chose a victim. And now because he is good God, he chose a victim to make him commit sin. How? No, that's how, what you say. You I'm are the one who said, are, aren't you the that's one who said the word? Aren't you the one who's, okay, you like the, okay hold on, hold on. You got aren't, the the one, aren't you the one you who said, snake spirit. aren't you the, you aren't to the one who said the word victim or me? I am the one who said victim, Adam is a victim, or it is you who said Adam was a victim of Allah. But I'm going to use 
my words, and I'm going to put it in its proper context. You can't take my words out of context you because said, you want to fit you your narrative. But you said Adam is a victim. Adam is a victim of who? Adam, so now, so Adam now, is a victim so now, of who? So now I got to represent my, so, my faith. Guys, properly. listen to this. Listen I'm listen not going to allow you to, to this, speak this to gentleman, my faith. This gentleman, he just said, your narrative he, he just so said that Allah, see. he chose an Adam as a man to be a victim in order for him to be known. What kind of a God? He made me a victim of his crime and all the excuse is he want to be known. Okay, I'm going to go right now and find a woman in the street and I will rape her and they will rape second woman and I will rape the third woman and rape seven women and then after that I will be CNN. Everybody talk about the rapist. I mean, what kind of God is God? Just because he want to be known, thinking of himself only, not thinking about the poor man who caused him to sin, who play with him, he forced him into sin, he caused a destiny for him. He have nothing to do with it. And now everybody is saying Adam is the one who did the sin. Adam is the one who disobeyed God. Adam is the one, etc. But the fact it was not Adam, it was Allah playing Adam. Adam is a victim, as our guest here he said. Go ahead, we're listening. Again, <clears throat> the Lord said in the Had the Lord, uh, the Prophet said, said in the Hadith Qudsi that when the Lord decided to create creation, the Lord decided to be known. So created a creation and made and made himself known through creation. Mm. So now the Lord is known by 99 attributes. The Lord is mercy the lord is compassionate the lord is powerful deceiver lord, uh wrathful the deceiver lord is many, many De names De deceiver right one see now see now see now, see now what you doing is impute imputing things for okay. the for let the, me let the, me show the, you let audience. me show you that islam have no job let me ask you let me ask you so now you're being a comedian Com the I'm comedian the comedian is uh, the comedian my friend the comedian is your god the comedian is your god who created a man he, you, cre he created a man. Like hold on, hold on. Right the the on, comedian. Show, hold on. Like, like we cannot don't even have the ability. We cannot talk in the same man speak. Let us see so who have the ability or not. Now what you're doing is you showing me <laughs> your own inability to be civil. You're not even. See, here we go. Right it's now. like a pregnant woman in the living room. Listen, guys. You Allah, see, Allah, he wanted to be can, known. Can't be Allah, civil, Allah, sir. Allah, you, you are not a civil, civil, you are a Muslim. You are a, you are not a civil, you are a Muslim. You call me monkey, you call me donkey, you, you call me you, you call me a worship creature. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You are not disciplined too because you don't worship God. If you are disciplined, you will not worship this fake God. How God he created Adams just are to abuse him. So how God, how God, how you are, how dare you? How dare you to say to me that God created a man just to play with him? To abuse him to use him just to be known what kind of what kind of god brother? what kind of god he do that to his victim adam is a good person to according to islam you there, see ev ev everybody is listening know how to have every everybody discussion. everybody will leave islam because man. of you now my friend let me ask you a question simple so question islam is let, winning let right me now sure sure islam is, winning, islam is winning absolutely islam is winning guys islam is winning islam is winning because he admit he admit he admit that allah allah he used adam and abuse him Simplified. and Adam is a victim Islam is winning listen let me ask you a simple question before you run if a I'm child if, I'm if, if, if a child if a child okay explain. if a child you are, you okay uh, hold on 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 you're, you're a prophet you're a prophet hold on you talk you talk too much you talk too much yeah that's see this is why Adam you talk too much you talk too much the reason why Adam talk too much the Lord had to show man the reality of good and evil you see let us see the good and evil yeah the the man the man who have sex with a sex the man who have sex with six years old girl is the one who will teach us good and evil Listen, so listen, 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 sin, Abdul, Abdul, Abdul. Evil, so he can understand Abdul, that God is both good. Are you going to speak? Are you going to talk forever? 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 The balance so that we will not be too <laughs> evil and not too good. <laughs> Sorry, I have to mute him. <laughs> it's like a radio station. <laughs> he said. And by the way, he's talking. He's still talking. He said he is the one. He said, "Guys, is my voice coming? Is my voice coming to you?" He said he is the one who said Adam. Allah is a choosing a victim. Allah is a choosing a victim. What kind of God this God is? A choosing a victim for what? To be known. Allah wanted to be known. I mean, come on. Allah wanted to be famous. What's wrong with you? Allah want to be just in people. He want to be like Sylvester Stallone. He wanted to be famous. Everybody is his name is a magazine except Allah. So Allah, He came with the plan. I will get a guy. His name is Adam, and I will make Adam sin, and then I will say to Adam, "Ask me for forgiveness because you are a person who disobey me." 
Allah, please forgive me, please. And the poor Adam, he is asking for forgiveness because he have no free will. And now this guy is saying to us that his God is a God. What kind of God this God is? What kind of what kind of God this God is? Now let me. He, he's still he's still talking. By the way, listen, Abdul, are you there? I'm I'm I'm, I'm not talking. Okay, I I have I have a question for you. Very simple one. Your prophet, he said, every child is born as a Muslim. Is that correct? That's correct. Which mean which mean there's no free will for you to be a Muslim or not. Do you agree? I don't agree. Okay, but he said he's born. You are born as a Muslim, which means you are, you don't you did not choose to be a Muslim. Then I want to ask you well, if you a, if I if a child okay no problem you, you can explain to me no problem means. let me finish my question if a child he is born as a Muslim and he die let us say a child he is born from a Muslim father and Muslim mother and he die as an infant he's like one month old do he go to hell or he go to heaven well according to the hadith he will go to heaven are you sure 100% sure can you show me the hadith saying that okay let's see I will give you 10 years to find me the hadith. <clears throat> All right. What age is this child that died? What? You said if the if a baby is born and it dies, right? Yes. What how old is the child? Let's say he's an infant. Okay. Hmm. Uh let me see it. <coughs> okay, uh, narrated Abu Huraira. This is in Sahih Al Bukhari, book number twenty three, Hadith three hundred and forty two. Mm -hmm. Uh, the Prophet said, no Muslim whose three children died will go to the fire. No Muslim whose what? Say again. No Muslim huh? whose three children dies okay. will go to the fire. But this is about the Muslim who is a children die, not, 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 not the child. Give me a hadith about the child, my friend. You are quoting the wrong idea, wrong no story. No Muslim whose three children die. My friend, is... a person, he have a three children, they die. He will not go to hell, not the children. Think, use your brain. No Muslim whose three children die. Yes, he have a three children. He have three children and they die. You sir. cannot comprehend yourself. This, he this have, is, this it's is, a Muslim, three, it's a Muslim. Uh, this is three uh, times I'm saying this. I know you got a uh, uh, English. I know you My friend, my friend, my friend. <laughs> No Muslim who's a three children's die. What the children who die? Who is the children? Three children, right? How many children? So my so I'm a Muslim how many children? children? How many children? I'm a Muslim yes. with three children, right. and they die. No, okay. you, and they die, yes. Who is the one who will go to heaven? The children will not be in the fire. No, that's not children. It's the Muslim who have the father. Give me the hadith, I will show it in the screen. Oh man, give me, give me, the, give me the hadith, give it to me in the text. I will show it in the screen. Everybody will laugh. You claim sure, I do not know sure, English. Sure. Okay, let's, okay, let's get let's get it out. <clears throat> book, book 23. This is Sahih Al Bukhari, book 23, hadith number 342. Bukhari, give me the hadith, give me the hadith, give me the, the link, the one you are reading from. Oh, okay, sure. How do I do that? <clears throat> in the text, click in the text. So I will show it in the screen so people they can see what you are reading. Oh, okay, so I gotta go back to YouTube. <laughs> No, not uh, YouTube, not YouTube, in uh, <coughs> in uh, in Skype. Oh, Skype, okay. All right. All right, so, okay. Uh, okay, I'm new to this, man. I had to download this app, brother. Why do I do this, man? My friend, you are there. You are in Skype already. Aren't you calling me yeah, in Skype? No. What do I do, though? I mean, I'm like, snapshot. Okay, here we go, here we go. I see it. All right. Here you go. Here you go. 
Got it. All right, let me see. Narrated Anas Ibn Malik. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, so uh, so now can you can you uh, read that so everybody can hear you? All right, I'm trying to find it first. Hold on. <clears throat> Just the third one. It's the third one. All right, all right. I have it in screen, my friend. Oh, all right. Okay, let's see. We're in the screen. All right. The which one? The height number what? Six three seven zero or which one? Uh um uh. It's, uh <laughs> 342. 42. All right, here we go. You guys, read with me. Hmm. Huh? Read with me. Everybody will see it now, what you said. And everybody, okay, so it's on the big screen? I, yeah, I have it in the front of me in the screen. Everybody can see it at the see. Okay, you're going to read it? Sure. Let me zoom in. I'm zooming in just people they can see. All right. Okay. The prophet said, no Muslims whose three children died will go to the fire. Who is the one who will go to the fire? Not the one who has a children die. Not the children they will go to heaven. It's in the front of you. You claim that you speak English better than me. Everybody, Man, you, guys, you just, said, you, just said, you just said some flip mode, brother. You just tried to flip flip it up. I did not flip it up. It says no Muslim who is three, three children died will go to hell. Who is the one? Who is the one who will not go to hell? Is the one who has a children? Three of them die. Okay, look, look. Anybody, but this is not about the children. This is not one. If you think this is this is not okay. Let 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 me let me let me. If you think the if you think the prophet is talking about the man, press one, guys. Press one. Talking about the children. Press one. Press one. Press one. Here we go. And this is the link. Here we go. In the front of everybody. Come on, y'all. It's right here. I'm posting. I'm posting the link for all of them. Everybody is laughing. You are not being honest. You speak English better than me. But yet you are lying in the name of the English. ones. Look at them ones. They go to the ones. Come on, man. Come on. You can't play me. You see it? You can't play me, old time. You, you see on, it, what perfect. you doing, old time? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I got love for my elders, man. I got love for my elders, but you just can't play Islam like that, man. My you friend, they are they are agreeing with me. They are agreeing with me. Do you see how many people are agreeing with me? Not like you. They're agreeing with me. On, they agree with me, brother. They agree <laughs> with me. Uh, come on, man. We Abdul, see, Abdul, the, the jokes everybody, it's recorded. Everybody will laugh at you. And now let me get you busted more. This is your prophet, said in Sahih al Bukhari. Read with me. No, 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 no. Read, read with me. Read with me. Everybody will be laughing at you in a second about your lies, especially now you are you are a certified liar. You gave so me a hadith. You gave so me a you gave me a hadith. You gave me a hadith. Have nothing to do with, with my this. question. Read with me. This is your prophet in Sahih al Bukhari. Go. This is your prophet in Sahih al-Bukhari, Sahih Muslim, saying the following, read with me. He said, this is Sahih Muslim as an example, and this is Sahih, correct hadith. Aisha, 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 shut up, let me read, let me read, everybody will laugh. Aisha, Aisha and Muhammad, they went to a funeral. Do you see the hadith in front of you? Which one, which one, man? It's in the front of us. Do you see it? Uh, okay, let me go to the, let me go back to the screen. Um, hmm. Aisha, the mother of the believers, <clears throat> Okay. Said, after they went to a funeral, read with me the top, the title. The meaning of every child is born in a state of fitrah and the ruling of the dead children of believers and of the Muslims. We go down. Aisha, the mother of the believers, said that Allah Messenger was called to lead the funeral of a prayer of a child of Al-Ansar. So he's a Muslim from a Muslim family. She said, Allah Messenger, there is happiness for this child who is a bird from the birds of paradise, for it's commit no sin and nor has reached the age when one commit a sin. So he's very little baby. Mm -hmm. He said, he who Muhammad, Aisha, her adventure, it may be the otherwise because God created for paradise who those who are fit while they are in their father loins and he created for hell those who are to go to hell he created them for hell while they were yet in their father lions 
So my friend, your prophet get you busted and you are certified liar. You say to me that Muslim children, they will go to heaven. You quote for me a hadith saying that if a person has a children, three of them, they die. You claim that the three children will go to heaven. That's a lie. Your prophet saying no. Nobody knows who is going to go to hell, who is going to be a fire of heaven because Allah created them when they are in the lions of their father to the hell or to heaven. Apologize for being a liar. Mm. Hold on, I just got to examine this for a minute. Ah. Yeah, this is a. Uh, it's a uh, the fact that the the prophet said it may be. You know, this is a uh, this is not actual. This is like a theory or, or a, su a supposition. <laughs> it's a theory, it's guys. Actual. It's a theory. It's a theory. It's a theory. Is a prophet well, is making a theory? Well, his a prophet is on, not sure. He said, are, you saying, are you saying? Are you saying? It may be. It may be. Yeah, it may be here. Maybe there. It may be here. Maybe there. It could. It can be. It cannot. Yes, be. but you are the one who said to me. You are the one who said to me. A Muslim child will go to heaven. Well, you are the one. You, I just gave you, you the you, No, no, you, you are. The, no, you lie, lie to me. You lie to me. You lie to me. You lie to me. In the same time, you claim that a human being have a free will. What is the free will? The child he did not commit sin yet. Why it might be he go to hell? It might be go to heaven if he, if he have a free will. Where is the free will? The child he did nothing. He did not reach the age of sin. He never commit sin. This whole, this so so why so. Deceptive. See, this it's hadith is clear. It's not clear because you see, this is the reason why you know, and my in my Arabic is I'm not going to call myself a professional. I'm very intermediate, but I, I definitely know that the fact that he's take care, fact, take care, take care. Oh. Next time, let your dad call me. Next time, Sayyid Al Mahdi. His name is Sayyid Al Mahdi. Let your dad call me, please. <laughs>